Alhamdulillah Alhamdulillah Dil manni wal ittidaw Al mutafarrid Bil khalq wal ikhtiyaw Al qail Fi muhkam tanzil Wa rabbuka Yakhluk ma yasha' Wa yakhtaw Ahmaduhu ta'ala Ala ni'amihi al ghizaw Wa ashkuruhu Ala fadlihi al midraw وأشهد أن لا إله إلا الله وحده لا شريك له العزيز الغفار سبحانه هو الله الواحد القهار وأشهد أن نبينا محمد عبد الله ورسوله المصطفى المختار صلى الله وسلم وبارك عليه وعلى آله الأطهار وصحبه الأبرار والتابعين ومن تبعهم بإحسان ما تعاقب الليل والنهار أما بعد فيا أيها المسلمون لقد جعل الله المكة حرما آمنا ومكانا مباركا وهدى للعالمين يجدون عنده الهدى بدين الله هو أول بيت وضع الأدي في الأرض للعبادة قال الله سبحانه وتعالى إن أول بيت وضع للناس للذي ببكة مباركا وهدى للعالمين أيها الإخوة الأكارم مكة المكرمة أفضل البقاع عند الله وأحب البلاد إلى رسول الله مكة المكرمة مركز العالم واسطة الدنيا وقطب الرحاء في كيان هذه الأمة اسألوا عن ذلك التاريخ من آدم عليه السلام إلى إبراهيم حيث بناء البيت وحيث المقام والحطيم وزمزم وهاجر وإسماعيل إلى هود وصالح وموسى وعيسى عليه السلام إلى محمد بن عبد الله يصدع بدعوة التوحيد في تلك الرباء والقطاع إلى أن يعود إليها فاتحا مذفرا معاشر المسلمين قال الله سبحانه وتعالى وإذ يرفع إبراهيم القواعد من البيت وإسماعيل ربنا تقبل منا إنك أنت السميع العليم وقال ربنا جل وعلا ذلك ومن يعظم شعائر الله فإنها من تقوى القلوب أيها الإخوة الأكارم أن المسجد الحرام هو أول المساجد مساجد الأنبياء في الأرض هذا بيت المباركة أنزل الله البركة على من يزور ومن يصلي عنده ومن يتوف ومن يتوف به ومن يحج إليه ومن يعتمر إليه البركة أن حسنا تضاعف هناك البركة هناك زمزم هذا شفاء مبارك هذا مكان آمنا وهدى للعالمين فهو تنزل الهدى على من حوله ومن يأتيه ومن يزوره وفيه بركة عظيمة وهدى للعالمين My dear respected brothers and sisters الحمد لله Allah سبحانه وتعالى has given us lot of ni'ama lot of blessings lot of baraka for the Muslim Ummah. Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala said, the first house in this world for the worship to Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala, Al-Ka'bah al-Musharrafa. Inna awwala bayti mudhi'a lil-nasi lal-ladhi bibakkata mubarakan wa hudan lil-alameen. The first house of worship appointed for men 
was that at Bakka, full of blessings and of guidance for all kind of beings. First of all, Adam alayhi salatu wa salam built the Kaaba. During the time of the flood of Nuh alayhi wa salatu wa salam, it was broken. Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala selected to Paygambar Ibrahim alayhi salatu wa salam and Ismail alayhi salatu wa salam. Dad and son, both of them together. They revealed the house of Allah. Allah mentioned in the Holy Quran, وَإِذْ يَرْفَعُ إِبْرَاهِيمُ الْقَوَاعِدَ مِنَ الْبَيْتِ وَإِسْمَعِيلِ رَبَّنَا تَقَبَّلْ مِنَّا إِنَّكَ الْتَسَّمِيعُ الْعَلِيمُ Ibrahim and Ismail alayhi salatu wa sallam revealed. Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala said to his prophet Muhammad sallallahu alayhi wa sallam, and he remember Ibrahim and Ismail raised the foundation of the house. They made the dua, our Lord accept these services from us. You are the all-hearing and all-knowing. After reveal the Kaaba, they made the dua. They ask Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala, O oh Allah, me and my son, both of us reveal your house. O oh Allah, Rabbana taqabbal minna, O oh our Lord, please accept from us. There is a lesson, my dear respected brothers and sisters. All of the masajid, all of the most in this world, all of them, the branches of the Kaaba. Ibra Ibrahim alayhi salatu wasalam left the example. Those who are doing the khidmah of the mosque in this world. You are donating the money. You are building the mosque. You are servicing for the mosque. You are helping the mosque. You are supporting to the mosque. You are the management committee of the mosque. You are founder of the mosque. You are donating money. You are related with mosque. Don't think you are, you are the most honorable person because you are related with mosque. Member of the mosque. Committee member of the mosque. Imam of the mosque. Muadzin of the mosque. Don't feel proud. Whatever khidmah you are doing related with mosque, after doing that, make, make the dua like Ibrahim and Ismail. Rabbana taqabbal minna inna ka tasami'ul alim. Oh Allah, I am doing the khidmah of this mosque. I'm donating the money. I'm thinking about the mosque. I'm spending my time for the mosque. Oh Allah, everything you know, oh Allah. Oh Allah, you are sami'un. Oh Allah, you are basirun. I'm not going to get so much money, so much reward in this world. But oh Allah, you know, you know, I'm doing everything for your sake to please to you, oh Allah. Well, if this is your house. Give me a lot of ability to do more and more for your mosque. Well, accept from me. Well, grant it. My khidmah, my donation. This is the lesson from Ibrahim. Respected brothers and sisters, what I'm going to tell you. ذَلِكَ وَمَنْ يُعَظِّمْ شَعَائِرَ اللَّهِ فَإِنَّهَا مِنْ تَقْوَ الْخُلُوبِ Allah said, whoever respect the signs of Allah, this is then part of the piety of the heart. Full of Makkah, full of the signs of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. Sha'ir Allah. Allah said, ذَلِكَ وَمَنْ يُعَظِّمْ حُرُمَاتِ اللَّهِ فَهُوَ خَيْرُ اللَّهِ عِنْدَ رَبِّهِ Whoever honors the sacred things of Allah, it is better for him with his Lord. Al-Kaaba, the sign of Allah. Inna Safa wal Marwata min Sha'irillah. The mountain Safa and Marwa mawjood in Makkatul Mukarrama. Hada Sha'arun min Sha'irillah. The sign of Allah, the symbol of Allah. The Hajar Aswad, the sign of Allah, the Sha'ir Allah. Zamzam, Sha'ir Allah. Al-Arafa, Al-Muzdalifa, Al-Minah, Shi'arun min Sha'ir Allah. All of them are situated in Makkah al-Mukarrah. Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala said, If you respect my Sha'ir, if you respect these signs, 
This is the symbol of Iman, symbol of Taqwa. This is the sign of Taqwa. Respected brothers and sisters, Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala said, Inna awwala baytin udi'a linnasi lalladhi bi bakkata mubarakan wa hudallil alameen. This area full of blessings. Those who will visit the Kaabatul Musharrafa, go to Mecca, visit the signs of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala, look at them from your heart. Your iman will be increased. Your sins will be, will be removed. Iman will be increased. Sins will be removed. Connection with Allah is going to be stronger. Connection with Allah is going to be stronger. That's why, alhamdulillah, lots of brothers and sisters, they are going to the Kaaba now to do the Hajj. Those brothers and sisters did not do the Hajj yet. In my khutbah today, I'm going to ask you, please get ready to do the Hajj next year. Be prepared. Be prepared, inshallah. This is the area for the Hidayah. This is the place to change the life. Those who visited, you realized how Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala changed the people's life. End of my speech. I'm going to ask to all my brothers and sisters, those who are going to do Hajj this year, may Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala accept their Hajj. May Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala save from all the diseases. May Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala allow us to do the hajj and umrah again and again in our lives. May Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala remove our sins. May Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala give the love and tranquility in our heart with the symbol of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. Barakallahu lana wa lakum fil Qur'an al-Azim. Wa nafa'ana iyyahu bil ayati wa zikri al-Hakim. Innahu ta'ala jawadun khalimun malikum barura ufurrahim.